And it's like, if you think about it, a million years is just that when it's in front of infinity, you know? Right. People, they put so much fucking value on this next Life 10 minutes. Time. It's like, oh, wow. But as soon as I say now, now is already in the past. You know what I'm saying? And it's the same way. A million years goes by just as fast in the, in the, in the presence of eternity. Our lifespan isn't even, it's completely insignificant, you know? Even if you live for a hundred years, you fucking, it's still just like a hundred breaths or even a breath, you know? But there, you know, there's but energy. I, that's because people are too caught up on the body, man. They're thinking everything is so, they're not opening up their consciousness. But See, if you're just conditioned to think that, you know, you're this body, then, you know, all your experiences are going to be What we're trying to like, say is you're the soul inside the body. Right. You know, all your experiences will just be in relationship to the body. But there's a higher self. There's a higher nature, you know. And that's, that's what's the important thing to find out. Because you even say it, you know, my body, my eyes, my mind, my intelligence. So when you say my guitar, that means it's Harley's guitar. So if you're saying my body, my mind, my intelligence, who's the person that's owning those things? It's not the fucking hand. You can go through every part of your body and you can see you're not the body. You can do it. You can see you're not the arm, the finger, you're not your feet. So we must be something other than the body. And when we use our human intelligence then, that's when we try to find out what we really are. What, you know, what this whole thing is all about. Is there anything you'd like to finish this up? Since you have to yeah, go I'll uh, finish it up with this. Um. If anybody ever wants to contact us, we'll be totally, uh, if, 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 what the, point of, the point of what we're trying to do is we're trying to like get people to open up their minds, open up their, their, their ears, you know, clean the shit out of their brain and, and take a taste of what's really going on. Clean the shit out of your brain and see what reality is. Because you'll never be happy just rejecting and rejecting. There has to be a yeah. positive alternative. You know? And that's all it comes down to. Because even if you have something for so long, man, you still reject it in the end. Or else it leaves you, you know? And I mean, if you're going to reject the way this society is we got to go on, man. everything, so then you also have to reject, you know, the lifestyle that they're pushing down your throat, too. The things they're telling you to eat, the way they're telling you to be, your conditioning. That's a whole nother, that's a whole nother aspect of rebellion, you know, rebelling against the conditioning that's like been forced down our throat. And you know what's funny is that people get so conditioned that they think that the more intoxicated they get, the more sex they have, the more material things they acquire, they think that that's what it's, they think that's the rebellion. But in fact, they're just, the way things are worked out, it happens up every fucking generation. People are doing all this shit thinking that they're being rebellious and in the end it just forces them into this situation where they got to keep get a stupid job just to maintain right, that right, position. Right, right, right. You know, like they got it, you know, as you're young, you're running around having sex everywhere, so, but as you get older, you can't do that. So you got to get a wife. You know, when you're younger, you're running around doing this everywhere, but as you get older, you got to settle down and get a job to keep doing those things. So it's just really a trap, you know. It's just like, you think you're rebelling, but in reality, you're just creating your own box that you're like going to pull the lid on any second, you know, unless you fucking Break out. There's an energy that's in charge of, you know, that whole thing, like, like putting you into illusions, you know. Illusion. The Sanskrit word for illusion maya. is called maya. And, if, you know, in fact, the, the title, of, this is what I'll end it with. The title of our album, The Age of Quarrel, this, that also comes from these scriptures. The, this is, uh, this, the age that we're living in is called the Iron Age of Quarrel and Hypocrisy. Kali Yuga. It's pronounced Kali Yuga. K-L-I-Y-U-G-A. And that's the age we're living in. And, you know, unless things look up, man, this is going to be the annihilation of the planet. And it's, and it's been written and it's back. So let's end it with that. That's beautiful. All right. Thanks a lot, guys. All right, man. I'm glad we got something good out of there. I hope you can just edit it down and keep the best parts, all right? Too cool. Too cool.